The next trim tool is called the Ripple Trim. This tool allows you to extend or shorten a clip on the timeline while automatically closing the gap on the sequence after you make the trim. To answer a Ripple Trim challenge, select the Ripple Trim tool from the Tools palette. It's the second icon in the Trim Tools section that looks like a box with an arrow inside it, with a solid line on the left side of the box. When you move your mouse to the edge of a clip on the timeline, your mouse pointer should change into a yellow bracket. Click and drag the edge of the clip in the direction that you wish to make your edit. Let go of your mouse. You've ripple trimmed the clip. If you remove frames from a clip, a gap should not be left on the timeline. In this challenge, watch and listen to the full sequence on the timeline. Ripple trim the end of the first shot, 1Y-4, to remove the director yelling boom so we don't hear it twice in the full sequence. Use the audio waveform, the wave-like lines that are visible on the blue audio clips, to help you line up where to trim. Press the show hint button if you need a little help.